First one, Al, is from Bobby Manning. Hey, Al, um, can you just look back at Rob's recovery process and just, you know, what he was able to do to help him get back to the court so quickly and looking like himself and just some of the habits he's developed to, you know, become as healthy and sustainable as he has this year. Uh, yeah, very, very impressed with, uh, you know, with how Rob tackled this, you know, this setback. Um, uh, you know, he, uh, I, he, he was the first one in here every day, you know, working on his body, working on, on different things, uh, conditioning, just trying to do as much as he can to come help us. Um, you know, he knew, he knows how much we need him. And, and, um, and, and I was just really impressed with just his consistency. And that just speaks to him, you know, all year, he's been that consistent uh, weight room treatment, um, you know, getting his, his, his shots and all the things on the court, but uh, all the off the court stuff, that's what's really impressed me with him. And he's taken a huge leap. Um, and just in this year. So, um, so it's a lot of credit to him and the, and the time that he's put in and the work he's put in is showing. And, and we're grateful for it because he was able to come back. We weren't expecting him to be back in the first round and he was able to come back and be with us. And um, he's obviously a huge part of what we do. Next question is from Mark Murphy. Hey Al, um, how has Rob's timing been working out, especially, you know, the two of you had a good feel for each other developed. I mean, is that back all the way or is that still a work in progress? Um, I think it's good. You know, the, the one thing that we have to take into account, it's in the playoffs, um, you know, things change, uh, how teams are guarding, um, the different things. I uh, do change, but, uh, you know, him and I are still on, on the same page. Um, uh, you know, I'm looking for him out there. Um, I have his back. He has my back constantly on the defensive end and, and on offense, we're trying to make the game easy for one another. Um, so there's nothing there. It's just us continuing to work and, um, and play these games and, and figure things out as a group, really. Next question is from Steve Magargi from Associated Press. Thanks for doing this. I was just wondering what you think of having this long a uh, break between games, having the three days off in this playoff series. Do you like having, would you rather just have maybe a couple days or do you like having this longer break in the middle of a series like this? Uh, it's, it's different. Um, it is. Um, and, uh, you know, I've been in, in the playoffs where we play every other day. And when that's the case, you're wishing, you're hoping, man, we hope, Hope we get an extra day and then and then now in this case it's like when when are we playing again type thing um so at the end of the day you know this is the way that it is the scheduling works out in this way and 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 we have to make sure that that we stay ready no matter what it is um you know we have to do the best that we can prepare the best that we can and uh, and just stay ready for what for, for what comes with it but um but but i feel like you know well, one end can be bad, the other end can be bad. You just kind of have to figure it out and, and go with it. And, uh, and we have taken advantage of these three days and, um, you know, looking forward to getting back on the court tomorrow. Any final questions for Al? Jonathan Hall? Hi, Al, thanks for taking the question. Um, what kind of an atmosphere are you expecting at the forum? Um, the uh, momentum seems to be in your favor at this point, but uh, now you're away. Just uh, thoughts on going to Milwaukee. Um, you know, obviously uh, uh, a place that's, that's tough to play at regular season or postseason. Um, so it should be a fun environment. Presented by your New England Ford dealers. Built for America. Built Ford Proud.